what's going on guys your boy amazing we're back with another video and in today's video guys we'll be going over how to get the free holy relic in global grand cross so no one has really went over this on how to actually get the free holy relic and in this video i'm gonna be going over how you can actually get it so before we actually hop into the video make sure to subscribe to your boy amazing we are on the road to 20k subs man um last time i checked the sub count we were at like 16,800, i think or almost at 16,900 from what i saw like this morning when i woke up so it's been pretty crazy but yeah with that out of the way, let's hop into the video. So the way you're actually going to be able to get the free Holy Relic is by doing the spin event. So if you guys haven't touched the spin event yet, if you go to the rewards here, you're going to be able to get the special boxes. And each box is going to give you some of the rewards from the, you know, the, the Holy Relic. So if you go to like this one right here, you get the blue crystals, right? And if you go to the one at the top here, you're going to be able to get the uh, actual mat you need, right? To make the free Holy Relic. And remember that you're only able to actually get this mat right here so you're not able to create like any holy relic um but if you do go to the world tree shop which if you go right here and you actually go to the brand new one right um you can actually pick up the green ones and actually pick up Miguel's holy relic so you can oh, you only get 50 uh, on this week but next week if you actually get the other 30 then you can actually get Miguel's holy relic uh, free to play which is really good and if you guys don't know what Miguel's holy relic is um i actually picked it up uh, a little bit earlier um yeah we also have this new feature as well miguel the bot um uh, miguel this holy relic is gonna be that when the hero uses recovery skill in the uh you know the bird demonic beast battle removes one debuff from uh, allies then applies one effect on the hero which increases all stats by eight percent for five turns stacking up to five times so she can give you five stacks worth um through her holy relic alongside her passive giving her uh, her allies, you know, 8% to all stats for 5 turns as well. And that one, uh, you know, can get up to 5 times as well. So you can get 10 stacks of her all stats buffs, which is really, really strong. So if you do want to be able to farm bird and you have Miguelda, even at like 1 out of 6, whatever the case, I definitely recommend you pick up that Holy Relic with the free one. But, you know, as I said, um, you're going to want to do the spin event. And to do the spin event, you're just going to want to clear free stages. So if I go to, um, let's see here. If I go to the main story and I literally just go to like chapter 3 here um uh, it, it literally doesn't matter but let's say i was going here and i wanted to farm like you know this out real quick we go here and we just drop a bunch of skip tickets bro oh it's half stamina free stages too go crazy guys go crazy but yeah and we just skip ticket as you guys are gonna see we're gonna get a single drop of this every time we actually clear a stage so yeah we're gonna be able to get a total of 30 a day so that's gonna be you know 30 30 chances on the roll oh i didn't even get the skip ticket 10 times there uh but yeah you basically get 30 a day, which is really good. And then, uh, yeah, you're able to, once you eventually clear out the whole spin event, you'll actually be able to get the free Holy Relic. So that's pretty nice. Yeah, uh, let me let me know in the comment section below which uh, Holy Relic you guys are actually going to be picking up with this. Because um, I'm personally going to hold on to it, I think. Because um, I did recently pick up the Once Holy Relic, um, just because I wanted CC on it. But uh, yeah, I'm going to be picking up a bunch of Holy Relics. So, yeah, because especially since it's uh, free-to-play farming now, like technically um you know that's pretty nice yeah so uh as you can see i have 30 here and then but what you do on the spin event is you basically just go like this and you skip and you just go crazy bro and uh you're not gonna be able to get this done on day one so that's why i recommend you guys start doing this like every single day but you clear your free stages and you just start going crazy on the spin event um because you're not actually going to be able to max out uh you know this entire thing in like one or two days right you gotta you know do it over time so start now while you have the chance oh i actually caught the box already that's crazy um you can reset after you get the box but i recommend just getting everything you might as well guys um don't miss out on the rewards there's a lot of free uh, nice stuff here as well um so i don't think it's uh worth to actually uh, get rid of all of this stuff um but yeah just make sure you are uh using the uh spin event to your advantage here and actually getting that free holy relic because i know a lot of people are gonna like wonder where it is because maybe they thought you just instantly get it um, but no, you only get it through this uh, spin event here. So definitely make sure to do it every single day and uh, don't forget to miss out on it. So uh, yeah, well, another thing to note, Tower of Trials is leaving today. So if you haven't done this Tower of Trials, um, definitely make sure to complete it. Uh, you have till uh, you know, about the end of the day today. So as in, at the time I'm recording this video, um, when the video actually comes out, um, you guys will have about the rest of the day basically to get this done. So definitely make sure to get that done and uh yeah that's basically it and uh, i guess like one more thing i wanted to add into the video um for malaskila when she comes out on global she's gonna be coming out in two weeks as you guys know and because of that um 
I will be summoning in two weeks on Molascula, and we'll hopefully uh, my summons go well. I'm only going to be doing two rotations. As you guys can see, I only have like 700 gems right now. Um, but I think by the time our banner drops, I'll only have to buy like one big pack anyway. So uh, yeah, that's basically like going over like ugh, everything uh, there. Uh, but yeah, I just wanted to let you guys know about it uh, in advance. Uh, but yeah, hopefully we 6 out of 6, you know, in two rotations. Yeah, that's going to be it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe as always. If you guys want to see more videos like this, definitely let me know in the comment section below. And I'm going to see you guys in the next video. Peace out and have a great rest of your day.